Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. I hope everybody's having a great day today. Today I'm actually going to be doing an unboxing video for the Allure Beauty Box and this is for the month of May 2020. For those of you who do not know, the Allure Beauty Box is a monthly subscription box that contains skincare and makeup items um, and it costs $15 a month. Generally it's more skincare heavy than makeup heavy. You can subscribe to this box directly through Allure or they also have um, a subscription you can get through Amazon and in my opinion the Amazon one is a lot easier you know if you're willing to go through Amazon it's a lot easier to cancel it um, for Allure in order to cancel you actually need to email their customer service department or I think call them and cancel but for Amazon you can just do it directly through Amazon so without further ado let's go ahead and see what got in the box for the month of May so when you open it up the first thing you have is this tissue paper and then you pull back the tissue paper and you have a little pamphlet on the inside that's basically going to tell you about the products and then here is just a little glimpse of the box for this month. Looks like it's pretty much all skincare potentially. Very, very skincare heavy. So the first thing in the box is this Acure Resurfacing Glycolic and Unicorn Root Cleanser. So this looks like just a little sample size, not full size. So let me tell you a little bit about this. Um, so the, if you wanted a full size of this, it would be $12.99. And you can buy it at acure.com. And this basically says it's a brilliant exfoliating cleanser. It goes on as a cream, thickening as you rub it in. With water, it turns into a foam and cleans without leaving skin squeaky. Um, and this says it has extracts in it, which may help brighten your skin. And it does have glycolic acid, which is also proven to brighten your skin. So um, as far as I can tell, the theme this month has got to glow. So it seems like most of these products are going to be helping for luminous radiant skin. So that Acure product is a foaming cleanser that's supposed to brighten your skin. And if you do end up liking it, it is pretty affordable at $12.99. So I love getting cleansers. Um, cleansers are something that I definitely do go through. So I am happy with that. The next thing is this ACH Essential Real Eye Cream for Face. This does look like a full-size product. It is 1.01 fluid ounces, 30 milliliters. So if I go ahead and open it up, here is the bottle. So pretty generous size. Um, so I'm pretty sure this is full size. Let me look up and see what it says about this. So um, the retail price is $28.99 on this one, and you can get it at Target. So uh, it says... So, looking in the pamphlet, this seems to be a Korean beauty brand. Um, it is a real eye cream for face. It's, it's as concentrated, creamy, and gentle as a traditional eye cream, but the attention is that you use it to moisturize anywhere on the face. Um, so yeah, it's just saying that you can put it on before your makeup, and then it looks great after makeup. In Korea, there's a new formula for the AHC eye cream for face every year. So, I guess this is something very... Uh, highly acclaimed in Korea, so I'm interested to try this out. I don't currently really put on stuff before my makeup, like as a moisturizer, so maybe I will try to use this as a sort of pre-makeup moisturizer, so I'm not upset with receiving a full-size product that retails for $29 in this box. So the next thing that I'm pulling out is this little guy, and this is the VDL Lumi Layer Primer. Um, this also seems to be another K-Beauty product, and it's basically an illuminating primer. Uh, the primer's pearlescent finish gives skin a reflective sheen in seconds. So yeah, this is just a little sample size, and I guess if you want the full size of this, it does retail for $32, and you can get it from Ulta. So here is what this looks like, and it does have some Korean writing on the back, some Korean text made in Korea, so yes, this is definitely a Korean brand. So, does not have a seal on it or anything. Let me just squirt some out. Oh, I think I squirted out way, way, way too much there. That just came out like in heaps, but let me just see what this kind of looks like rubbed in. Interesting. So, I don't know if you'll be able to tell. It definitely does give 
a nice sheen to it and it's kind of a it's definitely a pearly sheen it does say it's pearlescent it's totally totally pearly it also kind of smells rather nice but yeah that is very pearlescent so I'm interested to try that out I actually really love dewy glowy um, primers and foundations and whatnot because I do have such dry skin so I am not mad about receiving that product so um, this was actually a product generally each month with these beauty box the allure boxes in particular you'll have a product where it will be a this or that so this month you could have either gotten that VDL primer or the Anastasia Beverly Hills clear brow gel so in my case I got the primer I'm not upset about getting the primer it seems pretty good and I will definitely use it so the next product is this Curology Smooth Sailing Moisturizer. I'm pretty sure Allure actually addressed this, which, whew, um, some of these have the moisturizer in it, and other ones of these actually were mistakenly, they had the cleanser, the Curology cleanser put into it. So, um, I mean, if this were to be the moisturizer, it'd probably be a pretty standard moisturizer, but it could potentially be the cleanser. And what they say is to test it on your skin before, like just on your hand before application onto your face. And if you apply water to it and it suds, suds is up, you most likely have the cleanser. So um, I'll probably try it out on my hand, of course, prior to using it. See if I have the cleanser or the moisturizer. I mean, if it's the cleanser, I'm fine with that. Um, I like cleansers. If it's the moisturizer, that's good too. So it does have a safety seal, but yeah. Um, I don't want to give too much information on this because I don't actually know if I have the moisturizer or the cleanser. But it does say that uh, in the little pamphlet they give you the price, $19.95 and up for a set that includes cleanser, moisturizer, and a custom treatment cream. As far as I know, and you can buy it on Curology.com. As far as I know, Curology is a skincare company where you can tell them your skin concerns, like if you have dry skin, oily skin, um, texture, redness, yada yada yada, and they can customize a formula to fit your skin needs. So it's probably say $19.95 and up because probably depending on what you need for your skincare, um, it could be higher or lower. So that is that little bit about Curology. The next product, this is a big big daddy full size. Generally each month you get about two full size products with these boxes. This is the Skin Ink um, My Daily Dose of Glow Illuminate and Brightening Serum. So here's the package. And let me tell you a little bit about this. So let me take it out of the package first. So this is a very, very pretty um, product. It does have a ton of little microbeads in here. This just looks really, really pretty. So it does say that it's dotted with colorful encapsul encapsulated molecules of moisturizing hyaluronic acid, illuminating vitamin A, and clarifying chlorella. Um, with this serum, dry complexions can become bouncy and hydrated. Um, you can layer it under makeup, SPF. So yeah, it's just a serum that's supposed to really help brighten and boost your skin. So this does retail for $65 and you can buy it at iloveskinink.com. So I'm actually very excited for this product. Um, first of all, full size $65 product in a $15 box. So $65 plus like a $29 eye cream for face. Um, great, great deal. And I'm always looking for nice serums that will help with the skin. So I am quite excited to give that a try. I was just about ready to say, and that is everything for the box, but there's actually one other thing. And it seems like most months they tend to throw in a sheet mask. So this month we got the Win Glamour Base Sheet Mask. Uh, when you need a fa fabulous base for flawless skin, prepare with Win Glamour Base. So it sounds like this is probably something you would use prior to makeup application. I don't do sheet, ma sheet masks prior to makeup. Um, I just don't have the time for something like that. I generally like to do, do them at night as part of my skincare routine. So this retails for $7. You can buy it at winbeautyus.com. If you're feeling dried out or dull, this mask is the perfect little wake-up call. In addition to hyaluronic acid, it has collagen and peptides, so skin is left hydrated, bouncy, and ready for makeup. So yeah, it sounds like 
Um, you definitely should. They're recommending you put this on before makeup, but I don't really think you have to do that. Oh, and it says if you're one of the many people who find that she masks slip off your face, this mask's jelly consistency adheres flush to your skin, ensuring that all those rich serums are really doing their thing. And it's actually made from coconuts. So, interesting. Um, I love doing sheet masks. Um, you know, there's such like a quick and easy way to kind of pamper yourself, so I'll definitely give this a try. So, overall, I think that the box, it is very skincare heavy this um, month, and it might be because um, they're trying to really push a kind of pamper yourself we're still in the stay-at-home quarantine thing from the pandemic, so, you know, take some time for yourself while we're doing this. So, a lot of skincare, cleansers, moisturizers, um, serums, a mask. I think overall, though, like, it's a pretty good box. So, that is everything for this month's um, Allure Beauty Box, May 2020. If you guys have liked what you've seen, please give this video a thumbs up, leave a comment down below, subscribe to my channel. I really appreciate it all, and until next time, guys, I'll see y'all later. Bye!